take. Today is November 18th and we're going to tear the unit apart and get it ready for maintenance. Take this uh, Fresh Breeze Monster apart, ship it in. Uh, the uh, props are going to get uh, the nicks taken out of it. It's going to get balanced, going to get vinyled. So the first thing we're going to do today is we're going to take the prop off or the props off. And then after that, we're going to uh, send the motor in or take it up north, northern Ohio, and have it done. Got some other little things that need to be worked on. Got some uh, joints that need to be uh, brazed or TIG welded or whatever we want to call it. But uh, we're going to do that. Just uh, some odds and ends that need to be uh, done. It's, it's been 300 hours. And... Uh, Actually, it's at 276, 275, somewhere around in there. So uh, we'll go ahead and take care of that. And uh, it's about seven years of flying on it. So let's go ahead and take this thing apart and, and get going here and see what we end up with. We're going to take a five millimeter hex wrench and we're going to go ahead and take this prop off. I want to do make sure that the spark plug is disconnected before we get going with all this. So go ahead and start taking this apart. Loosen them. Break them first. And then once we get them all broken, we can go ahead and spin them off. Now, one of the main reasons for video in this is to make sure that I can remember to put all this back together the correct way, as well as make a video for you folks. Get them all here pretty loose and then I'll go ahead and loosen the rest of them up with my finger and make sure I don't lose the props here. And there's these bolts have washers on them and I don't want to lose the washers as well. So. here and then we'll have it loose okay Now, an interesting thing about this prop is this uh, part that it fits around is kind of scored. And I'm not sure how that gets scored like that, but I've seen it on other units. And uh, we may have to take a look at uh, replacing that part. I'll get some more information on it and decide whether to just to smooth it up or to go ahead and, and replace it. So, okay, I'm going to go ahead and clean these up, get all the bugs off of them, and then uh, prepare them to ship them out. 